Good afternoon, everyone. Today is June 8th, Japan Standard Time. Uh, the weather is partly cloudy, and temperature is 22 degrees Celsius or 72 degrees Fahrenheit. And as you can see in front of you, uh, that convenience store, uh, that's where the five kilometer mark was, where I left off yesterday. And as I was walking, I came across this bicycle mark. So, um, as you can see on the road, there, there aren't that um, bicycle priority blue arrow markings. But there is a bicycle mark here, which indicates bicycle lane. So, <laughs> um, I may have to recheck up on the rules about this, whether the bikes, the bicycles should be ridden on the road itself, like on the shoulder or on the walkway itself, as you see here. Uh, but anyway, so let's continue on and on the course and we're going to go on to Hosui Dori. So that's the name of the road we're going to be walking on. And from the five kilometer mark, um, the runners will make a right turn here. So I think it was the same thing as the video I did last month. So let's go take a look. All right, and as you can follow along the map, um, as I have in the description, you see uh, Sapporo Park Hotel. I'm clearly written out this orange, kind of yellowish building brick. Uh, but also that big hotel behind there is part of the Sapporo Park Hotel. And Sapporo Park Hotel, uh, it is actually used for weddings. Um, it's really popular for weddings. And it's within uh, Nakajima Park itself. So, you know, it's part of the park. So, it's really nice. Um, they have wedding campaigns, all the... I haven't stayed here myself before, but it's actually really popular um, with tourists. Well, before the current situation, it was really popular because everyone would tell me, um, yeah, we're staying at the Sport Park Hotel. It's a little expensive, but it is worth it. It's, um, it's convenient enough that uh, even if you spend a short time in Sapporo, uh, it, it'll be worth it. All right, and right across the uh, Sapporo Park Hotel, you see this hotel called the Hotel Life Fort. And if you look at the logo, pan over here, the logo to me uh, looks like a really fancy E. And so I thought it was E Hotel Life Fort. That's what I thought it was. Or E Life Fort. That's what I thought it was all this time, but it's actually their logo that looks like a fancy E to me. So that's the Hotel Life Fort. Um, again, I guess during the um, busy season, well, before the current situation, uh, maybe this hotel had a lot of people. So I'm not sure though. All right, so this is the road the uh, marathon runners will be running through, and I just noticed it's the first time on the course that has trees that are just this lush on the course so uh, the runners may not notice it because they're focusing on running and you may not see it on the camera as well but i thought if you're here walking the same path i am it looks really really nice all right and coming along come to this place called smooch coffee stand uh, it's to go only uh, but their menu, they have it in English, so they do cater to foreigners. So I guess due to the current situation, uh, it's only takeout only or to go only. And that Smooch Cafe coffee stand. All right, so along the course, um, you come across this really Japanese style gate. Uh, very interesting. Um, the runners, they, they might notice it, but again, I, I think the marathon runners will not notice it. But if you're here walking the course, it's definitely noticeable, complete with a vending machine there. So very nice. Um, if I come back to it, I, I'd like to go in there and see what, what's going on. All right, and coming up uh, to end today's uh, short tour, uh, we're going to end up at Horohira Station, Horohira, Horohira Bashi Station. Uh, it's a subway station on the green subway line, the Namok line, that the subway line actually runs under Nakajima Park itself. Oh, so uh, that's very interesting. I, I, when I do the video on Nakajima Park, I will definitely 
mention that again. Okay. So, uh, going on, the marathon runners will make a left turn here onto the Horohira Bridge, which I will cover in the next video. So, today's uh, word of the day is Hashiru, or run. Uh, that's what marathon runners do, they run. So, Hashiru is the word of the day. Uh, if you have any questions, comments, or requests, please let me know and answer them to the best of my ability. And as always, have a good day.